Guyana is asking the International Court of Justice to implement measures to block Venezuela's upcoming referendum on the legal validity of Guyana's rights to the disputed Esquiva region, saying the planned vote is an affront to the rule of the law. As public hearings on the matter began before the ICJ, the country's legal team said the referendum poses an existential threat to Guyana. I cannot stress enough the urgency of the situation that brought us here today and the necessity for provisional measures to prevent irreparable and potentially permanent loss of the rights claimed by Guyana in this case. Madam President, for Guyana, the international rule of law is sacrosanct and respect for it is in indispensable to international peace and security. Venezuela's National Assembly recently proposed five questions to put before the citizens through that referendum. What would become of Guyana's rights to the Sequibo region? These are the rights that Guyana seeks to confirm in this case. The very rights whose existence this court has twice affirmed it has jurisdiction to determine. Once Venezuela creates a new state incorporating this territory, and grants Venezuelan citizenship to the population. How will this seizure of Guyana's territory be reversed if, in its judgment on the merits, the court rules that the 1899 award is valid and that Guyana is the lawful sovereign? How will Venezuela's actions be reversed and Guyana's rights to the territory be restored? If Venezuela rejects the court's jurisdiction and refuses to recognize the validity of its judgment on the merits.